Welcome back to the Karen Wars. In today's first clip, Karen is offended another customer reached over her for an item. Let's watch. I'm not doing anything, I'm standing here. But I'm just standing here. Keep playing with me. I want to admit. No, knock your head off. No, don't do that. Don't do that. God, I got leave right, me alone. Yeah. Leave me alone. Don't, don't talk do to me. Don't Cause this that. is going to the news. I don't care. Do what you want. You have a kid, you don't, I don't care? care. You oh, should really? not have push her or wet over. I did not touch your kid. Target you to check their cameras. Take care of You should not get arrested for this, right? You don't care? You don't care if you go to prison. over her. You don't care if you don't go to prison. Care. So let's get this straight. I because I didn't up. say, I don't care. oh, okay, you don't care. Because you didn't say excuse so me. You're obviously violent. Because you didn't say excuse me. Touching my phone. This We're is being recorded. Have an issue. I don't care. So you're violent. I don't care. Okay. What's your name? This is my name. Yeah, it, it definitely is. But what's your name? With your kid, I feel. Then what do you do to her at home if this is what you do I to strangers? Do to her at home. If you hit strangers, you what do you do no to your kid? You have Look at this you kid, she's terrified. Look at your beautiful she's daughter, terrified. she's terrified. She's not terrified. Yes, you should have said, excuse me. So because, That's so fine, you, so let's say, let's no, say I didn't say, excuse me, you go quiet. hit strangers. Be quiet, okay. you should have said, excuse me. So this is the you woman. You have manners. This is the woman is. in Target on Flatbush and Avenue I. You don't have manners. And I'm going to give this to the cops. I don't care, go ahead. They'll find you. They'll find you. Do what you have to do. So what are you going to tell them? excuse me, point blank. I'm Quick glad blank. everyone's gonna watch and this. And I'm gonna, I'm about to hit you. I'm about to knock your oh whole head off. Say this. So keep playing with me. I'm keep not playing, playing with anything. me. I'm about to knock your whole entire head off. Keep playing with me. Keep playing with me. Keep playing with me. Yes, please do. Please get security. I'm asking you to please get security. You should have said excuse me. Point blank, simple. Should have said excuse me. Okay, so that because I didn't say excuse me when I needed something. Okay, so I reached over to get a yes. shampoo. You were over her, like just reaching to get a shampoo. Okay. She said, excuse me, and I would have moved her. Okay. Like, you don't have to so because I didn't say excuse yeah, me, you're knocking you people up. Yeah, because you didn't say excuse me. Okay, no problem, let so the cops I decide. Okay. What well, I'm know. capable yeah, of. So this is what I'm capable of. Okay, so you're done or you're continuing? I don't know. You're done or you're continuing? Because tell me when to hit stop. Smart. This man wanted to place a complaint but rudely interrupted another customer instead of waiting his turn. Here's a clip. You came in and me when I was in the room. Karen gets into it with everyone at this retail store. Shut the f up! You not gonna change my voice, sir? Yeah, so shut the f up! Shut the f up! Shut the f up! I'm 32, bitch! And I'm 22. And I'm gonna keep talking to her! 
And you stay your dumb ass over here. And make me. I'm not going to. I asked you. It is 9.53, by the way. And I'm not. 9.53 at night. I don't got to talk to you. Yeah, you're talking amongst us. No, I'm talking to her. And when I was talking to her, my voice was down. You seemed intoxicated. Who the f*** is you? Who are you? Call the police, like you said you was going to do. I don't give a or what? I don't. You're a child. I'm sorry, but you're exuding childish behavior. Anyway, what are you going to do about it? Ask you to stop like I did. And what are you else going to do about it? That's it. I asked you to stop. Okay, but shut the f*** up. You can't do nothing else but talk. And if I don't, so what? Am I showing physical behavior towards anybody? Shut the up, then. No. Sam, do you have to leave We're not serving you. You have to leave. I, we tried to ask. Anyway, yeah. When I'm done talking to her, we're avoiding the transaction. I'm a decent You redneck bitch. You are. No, I'm just because I have straight morals and I know how to talk to people listen, and I know how to present listen, myself in a public listen, space listen. doesn't mean I'm a redneck. It just means I'm a regular human being. Just TV. because I raise my voice don't mean I don't know how to talk. Yes, it does. Because <laughs> this is talking. Okay, you shut the <laughs> up talking to me. See, you don't know how just to shut talk. Just shut the up. Just shut the up. Just shut the up. Just shut the up. You're, you're proving my point. And, and you're, you're making yourself look get your really teeth stupid. Teeth. I mean, actually, I like the way my teeth look. Thank you. You need to get them fixed. You work here. You need to get them fixed. Don't need to get them fixed. I think my teeth look great. Look at fucking, um, what's his name? Michael Strahan. Mm -hmm. Nobody makes fun of his teeth. You got big ass guy just I like. I don't even know who that fucking cracker You is. don't know who Michael. <laughs> That's actually kind of funny. Do you know who Monica Thompson is? No, I don't. Because you lie. Or shut well, up. You know, no. I'm not going to shut up because I don't have to. You, you've been asked to leave by several store employees and the security. It is 9.56 at this so time. What? what you think that's going to do? What they gonna do? You're gonna get banned from the store. So what? So? That's just this is, where you stay at? A one bedroom apartment? Actually, I own my own house. Oh, I do too. Okay. I don't know about any of this. That's impressive. <laughs> so what else I'm you wanna talk about? Stop talking. Stop talking. Looks like you got lice in your head. So do you. Look like your hair ain't been washed. Like your hair hasn't been washed. Go <laughs> but <coughs> shut your mouth. Yeah, that's actually now. A Ain't nobody got COVID. Now shut that's your murder. mouth. Ain't nobody got COVID. You can then you right cover, now. Your your got COVID. Then you cover your mouth. Don't matter. Then you cover your mouth. Shut the fuck up talking to me. You're no, too close I'm not to me. Going to. You're too close. Um, you're the one that won't leave the store. So, if anybody's yeah, too close to you, because I was talking to your you manager, me. not you. It doesn't matter. You were speaking incorrectly to my manager. So what? Who the f*** is you? Her I'm bodyguard? Well, you her bodyguard? Does it matter who I am? Is you her bodyguard? Does it matter? And what are you going to do? What I'm doing right now. Shut the f*** up. No. And I'm not even. Let's keep talking, <laughs> bitch. You to. Let's keep talking to the police. Right ahead, and they're just going to What are you, you talking about? Yeah, and I'm going to leave then. Now. Damn, look at your dirty ass. You got holes in your shoes. Hey, you're damn straight. Because my you shoes don't matter. You got holes in your my shoes. My shoes don't matter. My you shoes protect my feet. You got holes in your shoes. Look at you. What the hotel staff gave these ladies' hotel room keys to complete strangers. The situation. The situation is, this is a girl's trip. It's all females. Our front desk rep allowed two men to have a key card to our room and come upstairs in our room while we were in the room. Walking no identification. No identification. No last, no accent for no last name. He did not, they told them Jessica, a random name, which is my first name, no last name, and he gave him a key card to our room. Mind you, this isn't the first incident because earlier, her mom, who's sick, in the hotel room that we're constantly on the phone with back and forth while we're trying to enjoy ourselves on the trip, said that somebody was trying to get in the room early and she had to lock the door. 
So, so welcome. She had to put a lock on it, and we wondering like why the key card is not working. We came back down here and asked for another key card. This was prior to this last situation that just happened around 3.15 while we're upstairs in the room. And our they bed. walked in the actual room, two men, one with a mask on. I didn't see them because I was in the room, but they're asking for me. Now, one time we even came in contact with men on this trip. And they didn't even know who she was because they walked in the door and was like, are you Jessica? Are you Jessica? They no, didn't even know who she was. I don't even was. know who he is or who the person is. I don't even know what they look like. I asked him, did you even get his ID before you gave him our key card to our room? We have so much designer expensive stuff up there. You know how much human trafficking and everything is going on? And you gave somebody access to our room just off Jessica in this room. I could have sat in the lobby just randomly and I like, and listen, oh yeah, where room y'all in? We going up to this room. Okay. You didn't even get an idea or anything. I asked him for his first and last name. He gave me the first name. You don't even want to cooperate, but you gave somebody a key card we, for a room. We also asked him, did he take the key? He said yes, and then turned around and said no. Okay. Yeah, pause and let him talk and okay. try to get the story. Okay, so once he had said that, I had told him I do not have sheets down here at the front desk. I will have to call my security officers to have my security officers bring them up to the room for them. So then after that, I had gave him the room. Then he pulled out hundred dollars in cash and placed it down right over here. And I looked. Oh, so you saw it. Whenever we all look through the camera, you mm -hmm. will see that he pulled the cash. He put it right wow. over on the table. And I looked at him mm -hmm. and I was like, "What is that for?" And then he was like, I'm just over here trying to tip you. And I was like, $100? I was like, do you really need change? Or like, are you just tipping me $100? He was like, I'm going to speak with her to see exactly what she wants to do. And I was like, sold us for $100. Wow. I didn't take it from him. I don't care if you take it. Your room number, he... Yeah, 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 I'm going to need you to step back. Okay. I need to talk oh. to him. Okay. Please, I called because the two guys walked in our room with their key. Um, the other Seven, three, three, with five, us, she was laying on the couch. I was in the bathroom. I heard her talking to someone. She says, what are y'all doing in here? Who, who, is y who are y'all? And they like, this not 3602? I mean, this not 3604? And we, she like, no, who are y'all? And they kind of backed out and left. I came out the bathroom like, somebody was just in here? And she told me, yeah. So I thought that multiple keys work for multiple rooms. So I called downstairs and says, two guys walked in our room. Why does their key card work for our room? And, and he said, and that's when he told me, he told me, she has the floor right now. Exactly what he, he told me that, it's, that's funny because two guys came down here, asked for Jessica and gave me your room number and I gave them a key. I said, wait, you gave them a key to our room? I'm coming down. I hung up the phone with him and I came downstairs. Which means who's Jessica? Me. Who's Jessica, right? I came downstairs. The two guys were right there. It was me and the other girl who's upstairs right now. It's my and sister. She said, we came downstairs. We're trying to figure out why he gave us them a key to our room. The guy said, what's your name? Talking to my friend. She, he said, what's your name? So obviously he doesn't know Jessica. I, got, said, I have a question name? too. And she like, what you know? She ain't never answered. And he said, your question. name, Je you Jessica? And I'm like, no. But my thing is, why are you looking for Jessica? And, and that's true. So I mean, so I'm saying, like, what happened? What was his response? He was saying, he like, I'm sorry, it's, it's, um, it shouldn't be an inconvenience. I'm sorry, I didn't apologize. I didn't mean anything. Can I take you on a date to accommodate? Can I take you on a date to accommodate that? Can I make it up to you? And I'm ignoring him. I'm ignoring him totally because I'm focused on why he would give anyone a room key. He had not once seen us walk in here with no guys. No, no men has been here. My name, my name is all, dudes. We never. never. No. I, I don't even know what they look like. We've been like. on a private my name is on the reservation. I put her name on there as so she can have a key card. So here. initially, he shouldn't even anyone. be giving a key card to a male if I put her name on there. I can see if a female came down here and say, well, I'm Jessica and I need a key card. But you gave it to a male that's asking for a and female's a, name. But not only that, not one man. and my name you is the original name Jessica. on the um, Where is the last name basis for you to estate a key? Is it like, right, can it be more than one Jessica in this hotel? Exactly. exactly. Well, he's saying... It's not just Jessica. It's just the room it. number. Exactly. We never came in Thanks. contact with any men. We've been on a private yacht since we got and, here. And, and facts is, we've it's cameras all through here. You haven't seen not, not one man. man. You can run the cameras. I've back. been here since last no Sunday. Man. I hear you on that, but that's not up, up to him to monitor that. 
That's that, I understand, understand that too. But it's not up to him to give someone our room key. With well, just the name, first name. On our room. We, we going to address. Now he, now he operate based on policy. At the end, like at the end of this, if it's an issue, nigga, that's something you gotta take up with corporate him and his management. We will. Yeah, I already contacted my lawyer. Right. right. So they can adjust sure. it. Cause like I said, if you say that's a policy, I personally I want it don't make sense. And can we see the policy? And then and then for them not to even know who she is is my whole thing. How are you asking for her and you don't even know who she is and what she looks like? Y'all can't talk about it. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Come on. That don't even that's not making sense. Okay. Do you do you need the other two ladies who um no, no, you're, you two is fine. It's, it's okay, just asking. Okay. Because okay. remember, it's mostly between the situation, mostly between you guys and, and the company. But uh, this is this has something to do with the policy. Exactly. Okay, so basically, I'm just going to document a report about what happened today, and, and that's it. You know. Okay. Uh, or see, there's no crime committed here. Okay, it's just mostly like a civil issue. So this report is just going to be, you know, going to be in favor of you. Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay. Oh, he totally. This creepy old man was caught taking pictures of minors red handed. Your camera right now. Don't this man. Okay. Okay. Look at all these fucking things, bro. Oh, sir. Look, do you need help? It's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now we're gonna delete no, all of them. All of them. All of them. I, I will delete all. No, we want to see you. Okay, them. we don't have to do it one by one. You, look, there's a shortcut. Oh, like, well, come on, come on. We're gonna do the shortcut. Okay. And we're gonna. Okay, we'll, we'll yeah. keep these, okay? okay? The wine bottle. Okay, and we're gonna delete it. Okay, okay. And so then go to. We said delete Yeah, we're there. gonna look at this. How do we. Yeah. Album? Mm-hmm. I, I don't know. No, no. Ah. Sorry. Oh, we know. Oh, okay, open that. Open that. Open that now. Open that now. Open that now. I talked it all the way from the back. Uh, 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 one more. Okay, try again. Okay. Give me this. Yes, because that's disgusting. These pushy scammers get angry when their scheme fails. My album, all original. I'm a, I do reggae and hip hop. Where you from? Oh, uh, Where you from? Sorry, I'm not interested. What's your name, sir? I'm Ken. Okay. I'm gonna give you a big autograph, Ken. All right, sure. To Ken, that's my autograph right there, Ken. Thank okay. you, Ken. We Thank don't sell so it, Ken. We just ask for a donation for the record, Ken. Thank okay. you. Uh, it doesn't I matter what you it. have, Ken. I'm sorry. No, no, I autographed it already. I give you change, whatever you need, bro. I, Thank you. I don't want it. I'm fine. Ken, I need Thanks. something for the album. I'm all right. Thanks, Ken. Small tip. My guys is around. I mean, I didn't want it. Ken, come right here. So. Ken, you got to come here and you got to give me a tip. tip, sir, tip, tip. Yes. This is, all my, this, this is my, tip, my band. Sir. Sir, Thank you, Ken. A tip, all, right. Sir. all right, I'm fine. Ken, Thanks. Ken, you pick that up, Ken. No, 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 no. Ken, pick that shit up, buddy. I don't want I'm sorry. If you're this man was counting cards and gets banned from playing at tables. How's it going? How you doing, brother? My name's Jeremiah. I'm a casino manager. Jeremiah, how you doing? I'm wonderful, brother. You know why I want to talk to you? Why? Because you're not going to be allowed to play tables anymore, okay? Not at all? No, nah, brother. You play, play's too good for us. Play's Equiva, too good? Wild Horse, all Santan, of them? and Lone Butte. Can't play at any of those properties. Can I flat bet? Can't flat bet, brother. I'm no, sorry. not at all. I'm not permanently a... banned. You're gonna be banned from the tables. You wanna play slots? You can go play slots. Oh, no. You wanna go up to Dude, I'm only up. I'm up 126 bucks. Plays too good for me, brother. Man, all right. Well, I appreciate you being kind. Not a problem, brother. You have yourself an absolutely wonderful day. Just yeah. No wild horse, no Santan, no Lone Butte. It sucks because no these are the best casinos to play at. 
to this yeah. event. If you want to, if you want to go play roulette, you want to go play <laughs> dice. I'm you fine. know I don't I play can. dice. <laughs> All right, yeah, thanks, guys. I can cash out, correct? Go cash out. That's okay. I appreciate the respect. Yep. This crazy Kevin is annoying people in this Canadian donut shop. Now you're going to say oh, I'm going to put your ass on TikTok? Absolutely. Yeah, you're cool, eh, bud? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're real cool. See, this is why Tim Hortons needs security, because there's too many crazy people like this around. I am the security, bitch. No, you're just crazy. No, I'm actually the security. In all Tim Hortons restaurants, bitch. Why don't you swing the cane at me there? There's no need. What, are you going to try? You're and no her? threat. Are you going to try and get her to hate me, too? No, no hey one needs to wipe. hate you, man. No one needs to hey hate you. Wipe. You just need to move along. That's buddy, it. Buddy, you're not going to tell me to move along. I'm not letting you me through that window anymore when I walk by the store. <laughs> Sticking your tongue out at me. Everybody shit. knows different, man. So you're still filming, eh, dickhead? That's right. So you get For the safety of the staff here. You don't here. have a life, eh? For the safety of the staff here. When there's the crazy people the like staff. you, we gotta make sure the people scared. are safe. Why would the staff be scared? They don't need to be scared. Well, they just don't need to put them. up Why with like annoyances. How are you gonna protect them? You're gonna beat people with your cane? What? No, there's no need. Video of them? All the evidence we need. I don't think they need your protection, bud. In fact, I know they don't need your protection. Bitch. What, you want a nice clear shot of my face with your goofy phone? You know, I can grab your phone right now and put handcuffs on you, bitch. That's my next job. This delivery man is angry. He needs to go through the drive-thru to pick up his order. All right, so I just want to share this with the Uber, Uber Eats group. So this is Del Taco. You have to come in and get the order, right? Well, guess what they're doing? They lock this because they hate their job. So they lock the lobby. Now I have to go in the drive-thru with a big old line to make a couple bucks. What do you guys think? Do you think they can just open the door? Look, look, watch, I'm gonna show you. It's not 10 p.m. They locked it early. They locked it early. Look, they locked it early and they won't even, they want you to go around and use the drive through Look at their watch. Look, 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 look. See, look. Are you going to give me my order or what? I need to get my order, boss. Look, they won't give me my order, my Uber Eats order. I'm here to pick up my order. Hello? I'm here to pick up my order. Look at him. Oh yeah, I'm trying to pick up my Uber Eats order. Your lobby doesn't close until 10 p.m. It's only 9 p.m. right now. Your lobby doesn't close until 10 p.m. Hey, so check it out. These guys don't want to do their job right. They close their lobby early, so I can't pick up my order. So we're going to put this on the Reddit so people can see how Del Taco, they're not doing the job. Look at that, trying to film me. She's she was just trying pants over her leggings. Not even here. She did not floor. change her clothes. She was, she she was, was horrified. She was the look on her horrified. face when she looked at me. Don't eye tell eye me how my horrified. daughter was. My daughter was completely fine. She said, "Can I just change did right you here?" Think that I having your yes, child get, get down to changing clothes in public is okay for your child? I happen she to think was it is in horrible. leggings. Do you know it what leggings are? Horrible. Do you know what leggings are? All right, ma'am. You were are you stupid? Do you know what leggings are? Are you stupid? Why are you asking it? You are acting You're stupid. talking to your employees like my daughter was back there she was. naked. She no, was. She was naked, not. But she, she was get in leggings and changing clothes. She was in leggings not and a sweater. Not appropriate. She tried on a pair of not pants over her pants. Not appropriate. That is appropriate. Not appropriate. How is that not appropriate? Have you seen the people that shop in this store? The skeezy men that shop I in this store? I don't care. The women she was in you leggings don't care and a sweater. That you're exposing leggings your child to I wasn't to exposing my child to people? anything. Yeah. Don't talk to me about my parenting. Yeah. I was not exposing my That was, yeah. 
That was not it a good call. It absolutely is not. not I am an incredible call. parent. I don't even not care. Your call. opinion not means nothing. Not a good I'm call. just telling you. If my she opinion was not means back nothing, there, why are you Because you're talking to all at your employees about it. I, do, I watched you. I do teach so them how to handle She was not naked. She was in Ma leggings. That shut the fuck up. Here. I don't need you yelling at me. I will be calling corporate. I don't need you yelling at me. I will be calling corporate. And I will let them know that you had your daughter changing her clothes on the floor. These neighbors would probably never get along. I want to be a tough neighbor, and I'm going to be tough back. I want them off my lot, and you're not putting anything there. Putting tough exactly, shit. The fencing is being replaced at your husband. You know what? I, I'm, you know what? You created nothing but crap with all your picture taken. We're cutting down, down trees, which actually ultimately helped you. All right? We, we took back your property for you because it was creating so many leaves and everything. What are you taking? I'll call the cops. My husband told me to call the cops. You want me to do that? Yes, and I will show him where the property monuments are. You don't even are. have, uh, you don't have no idea where the property line is. Well, you don't know what you're speaking about. You don't yeah. either, because you weren't here when it was put in. You have not, you weren't here when it was put in, okay? Or you weren't old enough to know. Don't even Man, go there. You don't know what you're you saying. You don't even know what you're talking about. You can't be a shit and take pictures and make my life difficult when I want to cut down trees and then do this. You're so full of crap. God, you've got me so mad right now. Well. That's what you get for being a sh that's what you get. You get what you give. This is what your you husband... You get what you give. You know that? I wouldn't have said boo to you, but you want to be a sh** and sit out here and take pictures and video while we're sitting there trying to cut down trees. And all you can do is sit there bitch and complain. Your neighbor, your own neighbor, has been assigned, get out. Does that give you a hint? When they spray paint on your side of the fence, keep off. Nasty Karen kicks this family out of the hotel. Why are you being so nasty? It ain't. Why, why, why can't we stay here no more? Well, she saw your kids in there. What do my kids have anything to do with this? Your kids were in the laundry room in our refrigerator. Ma'am, my kids was not in y'all laundry room in y'all refrigerator. I'm not going to go through it with you. I've already heard that you've been nasty to my other people. No, no, no. Your your worker was nasty to my kids. Your worker came out the office, slammed the door in my kids' face for no apparently reason. Why can't we stay here any longer? Why? Because the owner said you're not staying here. Your kids run around during the days. Ma'am, my room. kids don't never come out the room. Only They're my not two. You're not staying. You're not staying. The owner said you're not staying anymore. Ma'am, at first you told my wife that it's because it's, it's, kids we were in there. Ma'am, my, my kids are 14 and, and 15 I'm years not old. I'm with you. You're not staying. Point blank. Don't be back on the property after today. Wow. Just like that, ma'am. Just like that. Just like that. But you told my wife this hotel is not a hotel that extended stay, right? No, I did not. Yes, you did. She no, I did not. I told her she may want to go down here. Ma'am, you told my wife that this hotel. Don't put words in my mouth. No, I'm not. Because I didn't say that to your wife. Bring her out here. My wife, I'm, I'm, my wife said that you said that we can't stay at this hotel no more because you said that this hotel, we done been here long enough and this is not an extended hotel. We have to go down the road. My wife no, told me that. That is not what I told you. Ma'am, we have it recorded. Whatever. You don't have that recorded from me. Okay. Ma'am, all That's I'm okay. asking you, all I'm asking you. Yeah, wow. Ma'am, I'm telling you, I will report you to corporate. I like the kids just wanted to have a swim. Hi. Hi there. Okay. So, what's what, what's going on right here? Uh, it's just a kind of a membership drive type thing. Mm -hmm. that they do, mm -hmm. you know, every year. Every so. year. So the free the free swim signs that's in front of my house. They don't say a membership. Or you got to be late. The I am recording because I'm most definitely trying to send this in because you have four or five little black kids coming here. Come to swim. You tell them, oh, you need a membership. You don't need a membership. It's a Swiss free swim. Yes. I think he talked to them. Okay, because I'm most definitely going to send it straight to the news. Uh, go ahead. Mm -hmm. hey, Come hey, on. Fun, Bruce. Yeah. Now, I know there was one group that came up that the, the issue was they didn't have somebody 21 to sign the waiver. Y'all didn't say the that. Other one, I don't, I don't know. 
Hi, Bruce. How are you? How are you? I'm, I'm fine. What's your name? My name is Crystal. Hi, Crystal. Okay. I have... My kids tried to come and swim because it's sign in front of our house that say free swim, 12.30 to 2.30, right? It don't say nothing about a membership. Y'all told my kids, oh, y'all need a membership. As soon as they say, then y'all told them, oh, you need to be in a neighborhood. Yep. We stay across the street. We are the neighborhood. Oh, which, what's the address? I'm sorry. 3315, right on the same block. So what, it doesn't matter if I'm 30, telling you. 3315, 30, we across the street. Rocky Ridge. I'm telling you, we across the street. So what was the real reason? Was it because it was a bunch of black kids coming here? Because I'm most definitely going to record. I'm recording. No, I, no, I did. I, oh, I, I took all the pictures. I did because I'm sending it straight to the news. Because I'm trying to figure out the sign in front of my house say free, free swim. swim. Well, yes, the signs 3315 Rocky Ridge. This is this is Rocky Ridge. No, hey, my address is 3315 Rocky Ridge. This is Rocky Ridge right here. I'm on the same block of this pool. So I'm trying to figure out as to why. Was it for whites only? I'm, I'm, I'm just asking a question because why is it that you turned a bunch of black kids around? Because, well, first of all, there were no adults. Y'all didn't say that. Uh, that, no, how much? We can't because they could have just had. No, but I'm saying when they came, y'all should have said, "Oh, you need an adult." You like they, specifically said they, they don't have no parents. I had no. my. I see my kids walking they right here. But why didn't y'all just say? Their dumb rule is that they had to be from the neighborhood. Which is a dumb rule. Are they not from the neighborhood across the street? Is not the neighborhood? I'm, I'm just asking a question. Wild in Westmont is the. The, the people in those neighborhoods put up the money to build too, and so they're they're the people that can come. And, and they say free swim. Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry. There, there couldn't. There isn't enough room to put all. Oh, isn't enough room for the black kids? No, ma'am. We or just, or just uh, next year you need to you need to specify. Say, like these two. That's what I'm saying. It's a dumb rule to say free swim and to not specify of neighborhood. I get it. Because yeah. this is where we have totally a problem. Rule. I understand yeah, I because they're bad at marketing. I, I totally get it. Yeah, but it's also they didn't have any parents. Like there's people in here. But uh, okay, parents. but but the parent part, I don't want to hear because I was right out here. They if if it was really the rule of oh you guys need a parent, my son would have called me just like he called me and said y'all turned them around because he said oh y'all you, you're their color, you can go in, ma'am. You can go in. I don't know. Ask them. Oh my son, so, Poggin. My son oh, Poggin goes yeah, Maurice, so. So um, I, 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 I I my finger. I'm sorry to say. I cannot remember, so I cannot. Oh, okay. Good. I'm a lady. Okay. okay. Where, 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 Marie, they're off of Metacroft. They're like a few houses from Kevin. Oh. Yeah, Maurice was talking about that. Okay, so I just wanted to make sure because, to be honest, it wasn't a parent issue. It was not. Well, the free swad, the free, the sign that's in front of my house. I, my, this this pool address is 3430 Rocky Ridge. My address is 3315. So there's no way that we are not in the neighborhood. This that free sign go all the way up Tanglewood. There's no way that this is that no. Just say it wasn't for the black kids. Just say that, and I respect y'all way more. But I'm most definitely finna. No, it ain't no literally. It's not true. They, they, that they is true. The arbitrary line, and the arbitrary line is the neighborhood. I understand that you're appreciation for the, what the neighborhood is is my appreciation for what the neighborhood is which it is a larger part of the community i understand that so we are in the neighborhood though it's we're a, not in the neighborhood across the street is not the neighborhood across the street from the pool entity and there's like weird so why you have the sign going all the way so you mean to tell me that is the part of the bad implementation because, yeah no okay so that's fine okay, no that's fine, no, that's fine. So for, uh, uh, yes Definitely. But y'all put them all the way down there by our house. Past our house. Free, they did a pass our house. The sign's going all the way up Tanglewood towards and McDonald's. And then when y'all pass out the flyers, y'all always put the flyers put it on up our in house. Y'all put it mailbox. right in our mailbox. So, so, so yes, y'all put it. The it doesn't matter. After the day, they, they, we don't. They don't need to swim. We're right here. There's no. The cross street is. We're right here. Sky, skyline. skyline. We right, right here, here across the street. But, right, Go down oh, five right, houses so, down. Where, where the skyline tees into Rocky Ridge. Yes. We literally right here oh, across yeah. the street, five right. houses yeah. down. Oh, but that's I cool. Know. Yes, I've seen. That's cool. I've, Come on. Go. I've seen the kids playing there. 
I'm sure yeah, you did, but it's okay. It, no, it's okay. With not that can swim. No, it, and it's fine. It's fine. I get it. It's 2022, and I most definitely get it, sir. No, I promise you, I do get it. Listen, I do. No, I don't. When my kids call me and say, "Oh, mama," they say we can't swim because we don't have a membership. Then they say, "Oh, we can't swim because." Hold up. I know that because the, the song, I, I took a picture of the song, I'm, and I most definitely want to post it because it say free swim. It don't say members only. Uh, this time from this time, and that's fine. I get it. I raise my kids to know right from from right from wrong, black and white. They know. They already knew what was up. No. Because no, but you. I'm, I, I didn't I say they told like you they was in the neighborhood. And, no. and that's. It's a misunderstanding. It ain't no misunderstanding. When I know this one right here that got common sense of a ninety year old. He told you they was in the in the, in, the, in the neighborhood. He's. Y'all still turn and, them around. Or, or, or if and I'm, I'm fine. I just, no, 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 sorry. I'm adult. fine. I that's just fine. wanted to come address the issue, okay? Right. Because that's not fair. They're, they're young. You can have racism towards the parents, and that's fine. We, we take it all day. But towards some kids, it was totally wrong and out of order. Right. Totally wrong. I'm sorry. There's and that's fine. Okay, that's fine. Have a great day. That's it for this episode of The Karen Wars. But don't worry, we have a lot more videos for you to enjoy. Thanks for watching and if you can, please like and subscribe.